What's up, everyone? Uh, episode 11. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, 99er special. Near the end of the video, we lose audio uh, due to a, an SD card issue. And thankfully, the camera still picked up audio. So there's going to be a, a difference in audio near the end. Uh, other than that, listen away. It's a great episode. Thanks for listening. Peace. You have a PSP? I had a PSP. I played a lot of games on the PSP. That shit you know, was so actually, fire. You know, it's actually crazy. So uh, as soon as I uh, felt that I was grown up, huh? as soon as I, was, uh, I felt that I was um, like grown up enough, I decided yeah. that I was going to get a PSP because I was like, I'm an adult now and I, can, <laughs> and I can pay for whatever the fuck I want. You bought a PSP. So I bought a PSP Yeah. and I bought like GTA fucking three or some shit like that. And then I like lent it to Riley Brown. Never got it back. <laughs> no, it's not, it was never like Why a... Why did you get a name drop right <laughs> No, man. He, he knows. I mean, if, I'm sure if I asked him for it, he'd, he'd give it. I don't even care. <laughs> Do you wanna, but, dude, if you get that shit back from Riley, I'd be so happy. I want to see that thing again. Oh, brother. Yeah. We could probably make something work. All right, Riley Brown, if you're listening. Yeah. We need that fucking PSP stat. There's no way Riley Brown would be listening without texting me. You think so? Yeah. Why don't you text him right now? Nah. Call him right now. Don't put him on the phone. No. <laughs> Why? Because I want to talk about this first. What the fuck is actually happening? It's, it's just Elon Musk laughing at a deer. Yeah. Dead in the water. Unalived in the water. Unalived, big time. Yeah. And the next, if you go to the next photo, like straight lateral right. Why am I dolphin not <laughs> working? I think that's the original right there. <laughs> no way! <laughs> what the fuck is that? That's a picture that broke Elon Musk. I hate the one yeah. that says anti-vaxxers and then they're kids. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's like <laughs> that's a big, that's a big like boomer ass uh, fucking anti vaxxer meme. That's, oh, that's so tough. That's insane. Uh, I guess we should probably explain what's happening here. Yeah, uh, we we have an intern. We have a new intern. <laughs> His name's Quinn. Say hi. Hey, what's up, guys? Let's go, Quinn. <laughs> retired Twitch streamer. Yeah, yeah, semi retired. Uh, Might have heard of me. You might have heard of me. Yeah, what was your Twitch name? Uh, some something aspect. Uh, what do I no way. <laughs> no way it was that. What? what? Was it like main aspect or something? No. No, no, no. Probably. probably. Well, was it actually aspect? Main aspect no. was taken, bro. Probably some. Yeah, other main aspect. aspect HD was taken. It's still taken. Still to this, taken to this day. That's fair. That's fair. Yeah. So we're testing out. Uh, we're testing out the fact or the ability to bring stuff up and talk about it. Not that we do that much, anyways, but it might still be a sweet little thing to involve in the pod. Yeah, man. Um. Yeah. So I guess episode ten. Yeah. You got um, any housekeeping you want to take care of? Uh. I got one. In case you don't. You do actually. Yeah. No. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. All right, Nick. Um, let's just be honest for a second, you motherfucker. I don't. I don't. I don't talk about cooking. It's that motherfucker who what talks about fuck? cooking, and then I have to answer his questions. You crazy ass! Why are you throwing me into this? Cause man, I don't want to start any podcast, especially between you and I. <laughs> that's all. That's all my housekeeping was. <laughs> Just saying, fuck you, Nick. Straight first name, no last name, and you call he him. Know, he knows who it is. Oh, he knows. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. That's a salty motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was gonna say, uh, I was gonna say, fuck you, Nathan. Because we're still. Oh yeah. Also, get shit on Nathan <laughs> too. Still doing, still doing cold opens. Still doing cold opens. As cold as hell. Yeah. Also, it is kind of chilly in here, but that is fine. Yeah, weather's been changed pretty quick. We're not gonna go into a conversation about weather because that's like an old speak. That was, old that was episode one. Yeah, it was episode one. Where we didn't have anything to talk about. <laughs> there you go weather. again with fucking victory lapping it. Classic. <laughs> Just running it back. I'm surprised I'm still even on this episode. The last episode we were talking about me not even being on it anymore. Dude, and then it even made more sense because we got to see your a possible replacement, and I was like, holy shit. Yeah. He's cool. Yeah. No, he's cool. There's, a, I mean, I gotta get my coolness from somewhere. Dude, and, we had a whole, we had it like. When you went to bed, we went. We we talked for like another hour and a half. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you guys were in a different state for sure. Yeah, you were probably. Oh no, I was good. No. Yeah. 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 Okay, that's good. <laughs> but yeah, you went to bed and we talked to we talked to Dale for a long time. Yeah, I guess shout out Dale for sure. Yeah, shout out my boy Dale. Dude, we're hitting so many like name drops right away. Oh yeah, brother. You got anything to say, Quinn? Uh, you got any housekeeping? 
you gotta explain to me what that means. I'm the, <laughs> I'm the intern, man. <laughs> yeah, big big time intern for sure. I don't know house. I think it's house cleaning, and we both fuck it up all the time. Is it house cleaning? I think it's house cleaning. I don't know. It's just like getting shit out of the way right away. Yeah. Like, like if there's stuff there's... we talked about from last podcast that didn't make sense or something, or you know. Aiden gets beef. Or we get reviews from people. Yeah, usually reviews from people. So that we just like draw on it right at the beginning, like the top of the podcast. Yeah. Try to work on it. I think it's smart to just um, immediately squash those people. You know? Yeah, yeah, for totally. sure. Immediately make sure they uh, know where they stand. I'm, yeah. I'm in the business of squashing beef. <laughs> <Good>. <laughs> Jesus. By the way, is your mic on? There's a switch on the, I'm sure, on the front. I'm sure it is. Do I want it at the top or at the bottom? Uh, it's just the ones. There's two here. switches? Well, no, like you push it up. Or you push, push it, it up to the top. It's pushed up. That's Sweet. Okay, okay we're well, catching here it. Here we are. Okay. Um, yeah, I can guess. Or I think we can start off with some like I got like notes. Okay. I looked, dude, how long has it been <clears throat> since we've done one of these? Yeah. Fuck. Didn't do it last week. No, didn't do the week before. Didn't do the week before. It's probably been like a fucking month. You think it's been a month? Damn. Well, almost. Well, I got. I mean, now I'm kind of on a mad grind. I've got two jobs, so I don't really have a ton of time. I like to... that name drop. That was a good name drop, too. What's that? The mat grind? What did you say? Mad grind. Oh. I, didn't, I was like, I just went with it, too. I was like, I don't think Matt has two jobs, but I was like, fuck it. Yeah, I know. Some, some random guy in North Oklahoma yeah. named Matt. Shout out to Matt and Thank North God Oak. he's got two jobs. No, I'm, I'm working two jobs now. Cause yeah. I'm, You're a savage. That's why. I mean, yeah, you work six days a week, so. Well, I did. What's the difference? Are you I, working five days I a week to, now? I have to squash that, too. Everybody still thinks that I work six days a week. Wait, it's not like you you say it often. Well, but no, I got to make sure that, um, here we go, talking about cooking again. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, I work five days a week because it's the slow season. Oh, no, that's right. I'm dumb as hell. Yeah, you got, so, you got Wednesday and Thursday off. Wednesday, Thursday, brother. Yeah, yeah. Um... <laughs> What the fuck is that? Oh, oh, dude, you're actually whoa. Okay, you're taking this shit seriously. Oh, okay, All I right. didn't realize that you were that you were taking a. Are you are you writing notes for each uh, episode? I don't know. I, I fuck with that. No, though. do whatever you're I've doing. I've done this shit before. I, I fuck dude, with neither the have notes. I. Dude, I, I, I fuck with the notes I don't for know real. I was Mac. I was trying to figure out how to write something down. <laughs> that's fair. That's so fair. We, we got our we got my MacBook that's connected to, to the TV. And uh, first of all, I ordered an HDMI cable, and I ordered one because I thought it would be long enough to. <laughs> thought it'd be long. I, I made sure it should have been long enough to go from the TV over to practically anywhere in the room. Yeah. And the, there was either a ten foot one or a thirty foot one, and there was like a two dollar difference, so I bought the thirty foot one. That's so fair. right now, it's only a distance of like seven feet, and the other part of it is just coiled up right in front of Quinn. Right in front of our uh, intern's desk. <laughs> <laughs> I like that a lot. <laughs> the, the intern uh, desk. Yeah. I'll give you a sign that goes up there. Yeah, you're gonna get your own sign because I got one for. You got you got one for being podcast. <laughs> 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 like okay, now shit. Now that's written down in notes. I actually this is do um, this is cool. I, I I like seeing the actual um, just the commitment to it. They to work the, with. Well, both of you fucks. The, the, the commitment to, to learning the menu, I'm, I'm proud of. Oh, yeah. That's cool to me. Yeah, we're not recording this right now, but I, I do have to learn a menu for my... Oh, fuck, I guess that's kind of uh, a, a hint to my next job. Oh, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm trying to be a server, so... My bad. So... Oh, for spilling the beans. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be my surprise. There's going to be a <laughs> podcast filmed it? at the restaurant. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, dude, talk about cooking. Yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. Here we are right again, back man. fucking cooking. Man, maybe, right, Nick. maybe Nick's beef with you. I'm sorry, Nick. It might actually be real. Yeah, it's a real deal. You might have to, might have a good point. Yeah. We, uh, I saw a... I was listening to this one podcast, and they have a they had like their fiftieth episode, and they had a list of all uh, like the, the auto auto generated captions throughout every episode, and then someone compiled a list of all like the the most frequently said words throughout each episode, and they went through like episode one, like oh we said this word thirty seven times. Yeah. For us, it's gonna be just cooking. For you, it's gonna be cooking. Yeah, probably or fuck. I feel yeah, like that's uh, pretty big for you. Like for you, one. it's gonna be brother for sure. Oh, for sure. Yeah, it was the first thing my dad said. He's like, "No, oh, dude, says brother a lot." His brother a lot. I don't know, man. It's just uh, it's, all right. it's just a throwaway word. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> 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 um, I wish you'd be seeing what's on our screen yeah. right now. Um, we're we're moving like small steps. We've got somewhat of the studio set up. Yeah. 
Then we have TV <clears throat> with a live feed to the MacBook, and we're getting very important notes written down right now. Yeah. Um, yeah, I guess, shit, how's your, how's your week been? It's been good, man. Yeah. Um, yeah, just uh, doing the same old shit, which I'm not going to talk about because next thing I get pissed. Um, but, uh, <clears throat> yeah, man. I just uh, just house-sitted for my, for my co-worker. Yep. Uh, are you still doing that? No. Oh, are you done? Uh, yeah, today I only did a one-day thing. I just did like an overnight. They um, so it, essentially they just uh, like our owner took uh, all the managers oh. and took them over to Vancouver for like a little like kind of like uh, like a thank you sort of, but it was also like um like a sparking of like um what the fuck am I trying to like say like networking type thing? No, it was like it was um like creativity, I guess. Like it's like a spark of like. Just like let's we can oh, see what we can make or like like a morale booster type sort of but just just like seeing like other shit that we could implement at our restaurant. That's kind of sick that you guys do that actually. Yeah. <clears throat> but um. So yeah, it was just a one night thing. But they have a dog. Yeah. So you get hung out with a you get to hang out you get to hang out with a, a yeah, dog. Man. He's cool, dude. What type of dog is it? Uh, it's a Bernese Mountain Dog. Oh, big one. He's a little baby boy. Like he's, he looks like he looks exactly like a teenager. What the hell? Like, like he's just, he's just got, like, he's got mangled hair. He's got big ass fucking paws. Like, <laughs> yeah, he and just they, like, looks like everywhere. Yeah, and he's fucking sliding everywhere. Yeah, he's just he was really he's cool though. That's yeah. so fucking funny. Yeah, man. So you time. did that just for the night? Yeah, yeah. it was just last. So night. then you're done today. Yeah. Oh, time. like I still have their keys because I came from their house to the gym. Yeah. Then, so are you gonna yeah. cut them or? Yeah, I'm probably gonna cut them up and nice. definitely their car key. But yeah, yeah, that's fair. Just in case. But, um, who knows? It's funny that you talk about. Like teenagers, I was driving home one today and I saw a bunch of the kids running for the fucking bus. Like, Classic. They, like I remember being in that, like in that zone, seeing the bus because they turn around and they all, all three of them were like looking at their phones, walking. And they turn around, and they're like, "Oh shit!" Yeah. They start booking it, and of course the bus is right behind me, so I'm just like slowing down. I'm yeah. like, "I got you guys, don't worry." Yeah. Speed up, slow down. Dude, I had I had one of those moments actually the other day. I was um, running for the bus. Yeah, is it the bus stop like right in front of your house? Anyways, it's like kind of. It's like, oh no, it's up the hill. It's like up the road. It's like a one minute. What's walk. your address, by the way? Yep. Um, so <laughs> I'm just so I'm like fucking. I like watch it on my phone and I can see like where my bus is, and I usually just leave at the same time. But this one, it just like it's just like fucking blacked out for five minutes, and then it just like jumped like way past where I usually leave, and I was like, oh shit. So, oh, like, on the app. Yeah. So I was like, oh fuck. So I like, got out and like walked, like started walking. Turned around and I saw the bus, fucking high hands, like as fast as I could, sprinted, get to the bus stop, get my fucking bus pass, look, and the bus says, bus full, sorry, and then it keeps going, and I'm like, dude, what? So I was like, no, fuck this, dude, and I just like walked home and sat down and just sulked in my sadness. I was like, I'm not doing this shit. Wait, this is for work? This is for work. Did you miss? No, it's not, like I usually leave like... Way like too 40 early. minutes before yeah so i can get there and like kind of chill out and get dressed and yeah and then get down there but there's also one that leaves like 20 minutes before so yeah okay. i just waited like a little bit but i was like man like Fuck. honk at me or something bitch like tell me yeah and speaking of which like how canadian like the buses say sorry have we talked about this before what like how bc transit like reads oh, out sorry so. dude I, I saw that in um vancouver no i saw it in alberta they say sorry too. They don't say sorry. No, because nowhere else does. It's so weird. Why is it here? Because I don't know. Because we're probably progressive and left, and yeah, I don't fair. like sensitive as fuck. But no, yeah, it's just they it's just the say only sorry place here, man. I, in Ontario they don't have it. Yeah. Why does a bus say sorry? I don't know, man. It's, it feels bad. <laughs> I'd feel bad, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, an autonomous bus. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking speaking of which, Tesla's dropped their their like FDS for their cars like the full fully oh damn it what does it stand for um what does fds just, stand for you want to look that up, up? you can alt tab by the way <clears throat> alt tab also fully works disclosed good. schematics fully disclosed oh maybe it's not fds it's just tesla full uh it's full driverless system full cell oh fsd damn it dyslexic that was close, though. full cell yeah 30 percent Full self-driving capability. Apparently, that this is just so dog shit that it's causing people to crash it's more. It's rubbing up on you, hey? You just said dog. 
I want you to know that. I caught <sighs> it before anybody man, else did. You, man. It's rubbing off on you. So, yeah, of course it's rubbing off on me. Because I sit here and I talk to you for two hours. <laughs> I'm supposed to. And look at that. Listen, talk. Yeah, it's because I'm sticking it, my tongue or towards today. No, I'm not going to say it. today. Oh, damn it. Well, you say today normal, though. I say today normal. I don't say today normal. I mean, like, not not completely unnormal. Talking dog, though. Yeah, talking dog. You said the dog earlier, and I wanted to point that out. But because dog. I didn't, you had to point mine out. So I brought up fair. at work the other day. They're you like, got brought up. Yeah, that specifically. They're like, you don't talk normal. And I was like, <laughs> you <coughs> don't talk normal. I was like, you ain't boys. from around like, here. Yeah, you ain't from around these parts. We can tell. I was like, thanks, man. That's the best part about working in um, trades, man, is they don't actually give a fuck. What's that? Like, they'll just, they're like, you sound stupid. Yeah, sometimes. you look weird. Yeah, that's another thing. They love to Did point out, like, imperfections instantly. They're like, you look mangled. Actually, I said that to a kid the other day. Oh, obviously, so obviously you're very, part of Yeah, well, obviously very hungover, this kid. And he was, like, just sitting there, and he was just dead to the world. And I was like, you look so fucking mangled it's not even it's not even funny like how did you even get here today like there's no way but yeah fuck maybe I gotta do that more yeah I had a kid at work a couple of days ago come on come to work and he was just like I could tell he was stoned but I'm like whatever I'll just roll with him and he was like new new yeah and uh and yeah, he was he was definitely like I would I would ask him questions or I would tell him shit and it was just like you could visibly see it go in one ear and out the other. I'm just like, fry. So you're not you're not here. You're yeah. here, but you're like not you're really not here. You're not here though. <laughs> I've had I've had full on conversations with people like that, and then they're like, "What?" And I'm like, "What?" <laughs> no, <laughs> Dude, no. Matt and I Matt and I went out. So Matt from the episode where we talk about like his his mountain biking thing yeah. just for some continuity for the listeners we went out i went out and did a like a photo shoot with his some of his riding did do that i didn't yeah. even realize that's cool and uh one of his buddies is uh, um, yeah one of his buddies at 8 a.m i i think i told you this story i think matt and i told you this story at 8 a.m was like lighting up so he was definitely a little what a stunt what song. a buddy i imagine you can probably figure out who it is oh yeah yeah uh, there's, there's a couple of his <laughs> work buddies that I could imagine. And uh, near the end of the end of the trip, by the way, we were out at like the Jordy Lund Park taking photos at 7 a.m. And that was the earliest I've been up in a long, well, besides earliest on a weekend that I've been up. Earliest you've been out in like that fucking. <laughs> Especially out in Lankford. Yeah. I was scared. I was like, what am I doing out here? Yeah. Where am I? And uh, I, that experience is pretty cool. We were like wearing all this like apparel. Like, I actually got a t-shirt. No way, dude. Yeah. I fucking hate that, dude. What? I was the first person. I'm like, if, if anybody's getting merch, I'm getting merch. Yeah. Didn't get merch. Should have been out of the uh, photo shoot. I was sleeping. <laughs> we talked about this, though. <laughs> and you're like, I'm not the photo shoot person. No, I, I'm, I'm You fair. could have been in there. No. What do you mean? You're getting huge now. No. What? Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> what, just because you're a gym bro now? I'm, I'm a gym rat, but no. That was the grossest thing I've ever said, actually. Take that out, please. No, I'm um, heightening that. No. No, um, don't write that down. I'm not taking that out. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like that you went to that, though. Yeah, dog. It's D-A-W-G. D-A-W-G. Yeah. Dog. There you go. I kind of like this. I, I like having this up here. Um, I don't know if this is helping at all. I'm just throwing uh, up random it's, shit. Sometimes it's easy just to look at the screen and then throw out a joke. I don't know. people. If people don't find it funny, then uh, you can be on here and I'll find a way. <laughs> I'll just what quit. people think anyways. Yeah. Yeah, dude. I, I don't, we're not even getting paid for this. Oh, by the way, I don't have a setup for your pay. Are you getting paid? <laughs> you guys are getting paid? You guys are getting paid? Uh, potentially. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't need that. <laughs> No, we're not getting out. any fucking money. What? Do this for so long. Um, what the fuck were we talking? Oh yeah, so the, we went out. Yeah. We did the the photo shoot. The photo shoot was kind of sick. But again, seven a.m. in Langford. What are you doing? End of the end of the uh, end of the shoot. Matt looks at me. He's like, "Fuck, man! Like we got to go get like hotcakes from McDonald's right now." Like that, I'm like, dude, that oh, sounds so good. Oh, you did tell good. me about that. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> like, this sounds so good. I'm like, Let's go. Dude, hotcakes and then sausage patties? Yeah, like, sir. Nothing else. No, On a Sunday good, morning? Good fucking butter oh, and man. then some syrup? Damn, that sounds good. Yeah. And uh, his buddy, who's, who was smoking up previously, like <laughs> probably five minutes previously, looks at us and he's like, what do you, what do you mean? I'm like, wait, what do you mean? What do you mean? He's like, what do you mean? That's, is that not just a McDonald's like McGriddle? Like, 
No, it's not a fucking McGriddle. I, like, I didn't say egg or I didn't say, like, biscuit or whatever. Yeah, whatever. He's like, no, but that that's a McGriddle, though, right? I'm like, no, it's it's just hotcakes and yeah. sausage. He's like, okay, so a McGriddle. I'm like, okay, take half the ingredients of a McGriddle. Yeah. Don't call it McGriddle anymore. Yeah. And it's just hotcakes and sausage. <laughs> and he's just staring right at yeah. us, right? And he's like... What, what do you mean? <laughs> like, dude, it's a McGriddle with no fucking business. It's, it's without the business. Without it, the business. It's a McGriddle it's, without the business. Can I get a McDonald's McGriddle minus the business? <laughs> minus, and then you know exactly what it is. And that's exactly what it is. I even brought it up. I didn't bring it up. I, didn't bring it up. I used, like, the robot machine at, at, like, the touchscreen thing. But I couldn't type in without the business. <laughs> yeah. That's fucking insane. I love that. <laughs> and he's sitting there. He's like, so what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Dude, a McGriddle with no fucking with business. With no business. Brother. I don't want the biscuit. I want the. I don't even know what is on a McGriddle. You know what's, actually, what's on a McGriddle? I can tell you what's on a McGriddle. Because I'm, I'm a fat fuck. Um, so I'll tell you, dude. You want to know the most surprising thing that's on a McGriddle? Is it like some sort of sauce? Let me guess. It's a cheese slice. There's a cheeky uh, little cheese slice in between uh, pancakes, brother. What the fuck? Yeah. Sausage McGriddle. Look at this shit. Oh, they've got like well, an the, there's like that's the bare bones one. That would be a fucking. That's what you should have got. A hot cake with, without a Oh, business. those are two pancakes. That's, they're, yeah, they're maple syrup filled. Wait. Yeah, they got little patties. That's it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, no, that's what a sausage McGriddle... So that's what you should have bought instead. And maybe that's what he was thinking that you were getting. But no, there's oh, other ones no. that have like the egg and like the cheese and like... Oh, no. All that shit. But it's so... I don't like that they have this readily available. They, they have, have a to, whole like, ass <laughs> You can probably order off this, too. Probably. Oh, fuck. But yeah, no, you, you guys could have gotten one of those, probably. So I just shit... All over him, but it made a great, uh, a great I mean, moment. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah! He was definitely thinking about that, but that's what you were thinking of. Oh damn it! Yeah, big breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck's a big breakfast? Big breakfast with hotcakes? There's I, a fucking I, Jesus. Damn bro. it, man! So, uh, see, that's what I got: hotcakes and sausage. I mean, technically, I did ask and I did tell him straight up the hotcakes and sausage. Yeah, and he's like, yeah, McGriddle. Yeah, I didn't know there was a sausage maker. Was... I didn't until right now. Like I, I, it, it slipped my mind. Oh damn! But oh, um, I feel like a big stupid right now. Nah. Sorry, I'm, man. I'm be honest. I didn't know what a McGriddle was until about like uh, three minutes ago. Dude, Let's go. Apparently, it's because uh, like McGriddles aren't always on the menu. They no, all, they always have. Out, bro. Oh, is that it? Yeah. But then they have hotcakes and sausage. Yeah, but it's not. That's not a hotcake. Is that not a pancake? No, it's it's literally a fucking. It's it's essentially a pancake. But it's like injected with maple syrup. Like there's syrup in the bun. Oh. Oh, so it's a bun with maple syrup? Yeah, the other one's just like a dry ass fucking. Pancake. Okay, no, I take it back. Yeah, McGriddle fucked the business. Without a business. No like, business. That's what business. that is? Yeah. I, that's what I'm calling it. Fuck yeah, dude. Yeah, no no egg and then no cheese. Yeah, see, there it is. Oh, that cheese looks so gross, man. I just don't understand. Like, the, in my mind, because that's right on a fucking pancake. Yeah, yeah. So you're putting cheese on a pancake? Quick thing, hey like, Quinn, you like want to try in the middle? turning on the camera again when you got sick? Everything in the middle yeah. there. So it made a noise a bit ago. We'll, we'll, sorry, and we'll no, get back to this. this so, um, turn it off and then on, and then on like the top right. If you're looking at the back, yeah, your fingers. There's a red dot near you. It's on. It's a weird part. It's like on the grip of the camera. No, 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 no you're, you're fine. We're gonna cut this. We'll cut it. Okay. Yeah, 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 just hit it. Okay, that's, there you go. So <laughs> it makes yeah. that noise, and then you know that noise that it just made? Yeah, It'll make, make another one like that when it shuts off, and the camera lens will just go in. Oh, fuck, I didn't hear it the first time. That's fine. Well, I didn't hear it the first time. <laughs> no, I heard it, but we were in the middle of it. See, like, we were in the middle of a conversation that happens. I just don't care. So then the video, when I upload it on YouTube, it's just like half an hour, and then I just have, like, Usually nothing yeah. for the rest of it. That's it's really fucking annoying. Because we don't have really a person jank. to do that. But yeah. now we do. Um, Shout out, Quinn. Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll press the button. Fuck yeah, yeah button press big it. professional button <laughs> presser. Uh, okay, yeah, backs. We're but no, like soft. everything in the middle here goes yeah. well together. Like that's fine. Cheesy eggs and Speaking which, McDonald's, I don't want McDonald's to know my location. So just hit block on that <laughs> shit. What the fuck? Griddle cake, folded egg, <laughs> sausage patty, you got pasteurized processed up. American cheese, and... Cl- the fuck is clarified butter? So clarified butter, do you want this, or do you not? Does Nick want this? Yeah, Nick doesn't want it. <laughs> um, is, that's just a clarification on butter. Like this one specifically, butter? No. Uh, so clarified butter is. Bring back Thai sauce. I know he said that. That's why I burst out laughing earlier. Um, 
So, no, clarified butter is you would take like a, a random stick of butter, like, or like, a, I'm sure at a... Oh, at we a, got a clock up there too. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, no, you're good, brother. I, I'm sure at like a, like a major scale like this, it wouldn't, um, it wouldn't happen like this, but like, we used to do it at the restaurant a lot. Yeah. Um, you would take a stick of butter and you would melt it. Yeah. And you know how you like see melted butter? There's like little like clumps of like yeah, foamy yeah. Yeah. And, like white shit. It's so that. that. That's your, those are milk solids is what that's called. Right. Um, and what you're doing with clarifying is you're separating that. Oh, so, so this is essentially like butter oil is what this is clarified um, butter oil yeah so that's what clarified butter is does peanut butter have that sure like nut butter oil nut butter oil <laughs> it sounds like it has another purpose yeah that's <laughs> exactly <laughs> you guys um, fuck with coconut oil yeah I said that I said that up ruining my own joke that sucks man. <laughs> that'll happen man god damn it man yeah um no coconut uh, Coconut milk's good. <sighs> what were we talking about? The fucking this? The, oh, yeah, no business. business. No business. Yeah. Yeah, that was us finishing that. Um, you ever hear about... Um, you ever hear about non-pizza left beef? Brother. Do you know what I'm talking about? No. All right, pull that up. Non-pizza left beef was this, like, old-ass internet photo, and it's so fucking funny. My buddies and I joke about it. <laughs> no way they got fucking the the Vlogbrothers dude to do it. Is that a Vlogbrothers guy? Yeah. That's fucking, that's one of the <laughs> Have dudes. you heard about this? I, I, sw- I think I've seen this picture before, but I have no fucking Dude, idea. so, yeah, look, click on that. No pizza left me, huh? <laughs> dude, so someone, I think the story is, if you click on the, the second pi- the photo, yeah, yeah. Oh, I can't read that. See if I you think can, you can click that. Enhance. Enhance. Enhance? See if you can. I don't know. I don't it really might, care. Yeah, it might be that one. Or I think... Dude, I'm not Mac inclined. Uh, oh, the bottom right. Visit? Oh, oh, no, you got it. You oh, got over it. Over here. Reflections of the 10th anniversary. Right. Yeah, okay. This is That's a big-ass millennial thing. Is anniversaries of internet memes. Oh, so mangled. Um, I think you have to scroll up. So, I think this story... Well, maybe you just go down to the page. Oh, there we go. Scroll up a little bit. On October 19th, 2007. Oh, it's almost the, it is the 15th anniversary. Let's go. Malero posted the results of this experiment on his humor blog. The sneeze. Why did people have blogs? I guess, I don't know, we got a podcast. It's not really much different. Essentially Are we checking way. out the sneeze? No, I was just about to check that out. <laughs> <laughs> go back to the story, though. We'll go back to the sneeze after. No okay. Way. You... Huh? I think it was an ad. Yeah. I just sure. It. Okay, we'll do that. Um, <laughs> so, do you want to read it, or do you want me to read it? No, you. Can, you. I'm illiterate, so you. <laughs> okay. So basically, basically, right. I guess in 2007, this is before like all the apps uh, for like Domino's and stuff came out. Yeah. And like you know how you go in Domino's, and Domino's has where you can direct where what part of the pizza has the toppings or yeah. the sauce. So I think they just uh, they just tried it. Are they they like this? Oh, I don't know what it was. I don't know what pizza shop it was or whatever. Pizza time. <laughs> I think uh, I think it was just this random one, and it had the setup just like that Domino's one where you could choose which side the toppings are on. And he's like, fuck it. I'm going to get no pizza, or what was it, none pizza. And then, yeah, he has nothing on the pizza, no sauce, no cheese, no vegetables, nothing. And then pizza, or and then beef on the left side of the pizza. So if you scroll up, I'm going to have to edit this photo in for sure. And uh, <clears throat> there it is. Look at, go to the top left. Yeah. None pizza, left side beef. Brother, what the fuck is that pizza box? Why is it six oh, inches it's deep? Oh, it's deep dish. This is probably Chicago. It's got to be, right? Deep dish Chicago? That's a Chicago thing, right? Deep dish, yeah. Damn. That's mangled. That's one of the worst things I've ever seen. Yeah, none pizza left beef. What a terrible fucking thing. And then go, yeah, click that middle one. You were just on it. No, down, 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 down. Yeah, so do, that's sort of... Oh, what, so that's like the thing. That's yeah. like a layout. So you're choosing the layout. Yeah. Oh, it's a... Reddit thing. Hit the, the visit on the Reddit. I just sounded 900. Yeah, hit the Reddit button. Yeah, so you get to choose... What side? You get to choose your toppings, and he hit none of everything. <laughs> Left side beef. Uh, Left side beef sounds like coast. a really, really shit, like, gang rock rivalry. Oh. oh, rock band, too, yeah. Left side beef? Yeah. No, that's fair. Fuck yeah, dude. I follow this, this Instagram account called Catatonic Youth, 
and they just post like the really really unfortunately shitty bands like rappers or artists wow. dude they posted Darren Day, unfortunately. <laughs> Wait, you guys have been seeing him too? <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, he won't Brother. stop coming up on my Instagram ads. Yeah, Bro, 100%. What? You get Instagram ads for Darren Day? Yeah, you know the tree slide? No. Brother. No way he has his shit. Oh, yeah, we can put this on. Uh, oh, yeah. You no. Can. You definitely know about this. What is this? Is it? Yeah. The, I, won't get, I won't stop getting Instagram ads for this. Yeah, put it on mute. You I don't think we can. No, I haven't. I've seen the TV Coachella. Yeah. Wait, do you want do you want this on mute or not? Yeah, the TV, the def- TV's definitely. Muted, m- what? The TV's muted. Oh, TV's muted. Yeah, you're fine. Um, oh no way. Well, it's, it's a dance tutorial music video. No, that's uh, there. No right there. way. He's that's wearing a Vancouver jersey. That's a Vancouver uh, Vancouver Grizzlies. Too. It is. It's an old one. Had a girl. What um, the fuck? Okay, scroll down. How many views does this have? Probably way more than there should be. Hundred thousand. Okay, Stream 000. the tree slide. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to listen to this after. That's he <laughs> is ahead of his time. Darren Day composes a fun and smart piece as a forward-thinking forward. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Raj, Raj, we're gonna have to get a grip. Somebody wants to cut him. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I like that a lot. Oh, uh, you know what? Okay, I gotta be. I gotta be straight up. We, I, I don't think we should rag on this guy. You don't think so? No, nah, man, he's he's from the ends. Yeah, he, my brother dated his sister. Really? Yeah. Get okay, your brother on. Yeah. Get your yeah. Get your brother on, and we'll talk about about Darren Day's sister. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Um, I'm gonna start doing this at paparazzi. No fucking way. That's a Wait, Victoria. What? That's well, a Victoria Darren, bar. Darren's a Victoria thing. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. I think we should we should hype him up. Well, he's performing at Darcy's. I keep getting ads for that too. He's performing at Darcy's in Langford. Oh <laughs> yeah, that's right. When is that? I don't know. I, I'll don't say that like you're excited though. Yeah, I, might, I like, might have to check it what out. Is this, this is a show at this point. <laughs> yeah, good, uh, I good mean, Darren. I mean, fuck it. Yeah, we're all trying to get out. I, I mean, how do you guys know this guy? I only know him because I won't stop getting ads of him. He's Dude. on. His dad's on. His dad's a realtor. His dad. Here. Darren Day. Yeah. Is the biggest realtor in Victoria. Yeah. When you drive toward, when stops. you go to Langford, yeah, he's on bus stop ads. When you drive to Langford, and you know, there's that big. Like right by the Costco, wait, right on the exit to Costco. Yeah. yeah. There's that um, big billboard, like the TV billboard. The Jumbotron okay. thing. Jumbotron, yeah. His face comes up there. Like, look up Darren Day. Sure. You might even recognize him. No, yeah. Darren Day, Darren Day Senior is like as popular as Dodd's Furniture. Yeah. Oh shit. Like, you, you know, you know, Gordon Dodd, right? Yeah, yeah, I know Dodd. You okay. got the Indiana Jones commercials. Yeah, <sighs> Indiana <sighs> Jones. Yeah. Indiana Dodd. Yeah, Indiana that's, Dodd. That's Darren. Look at him. Man. That's Darren Day. Yeah. No, this guy is mad. I didn't know him uh, literally until we were driving past one of the bus stops, and then my brother was like, "I did." Oh yeah, I dated his daughter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then show. his son's name is Darren Day. Look Which up Coachella. Super we unique. Can't, I can't. I saw for that one too. Yeah, that's good. Because he remade it. Oh, no slow mo on that. Damn, I feel bad for people who are listening because there's no way I'm gonna be able to edit all this stuff in. It's only a hundred nine thousand views. So this podcast that I listen to. Um, uh, they, uh, this is so, no, no, I gotta hype him up, man. I can't, I can't be on the other side. Dude's from Victoria. So this podcast I listened to, they ended up actually finding, someone sent him this video. Scroll, scroll down, please. Yes. <laughs> Look at the bottom right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I saw a sneak peek of that and I knew exactly what it was. Quick. Test now. Are you talking about the gay test? Yeah. Of course I'm talking about the gay test. Do not hit that. Do not, <laughs> not touch that. I said it's fixed on targeted ads. I love that. Um, that's insane. Damn. Yeah, so Oh, that's they God. they found the video and they clowned him pretty hard and I was like, damn man. That being said, they clowned him because of this. It's a pretty cringy song, but if you go and look up on his account, he actually remade the song. Which is, yeah, there it is. Oh, no. One year ago, yeah, if you go to the right. Oh, you're fine. Ah, dude. Yeah, so he he remade the song, and it didn't actually sound bad. Like, the first one was kind of... This one here? Yeah, yeah. I mean, we're, we can't play There's it. There's no volume. Yeah. It's, music video. Um, he re- remade it, and it actually sounded way better than the first one. Like, the first one, he's, like, a little bit off-key and, like, off, doesn't have his voice quite yet. Mm. But he remade it, and it didn't sound actually too bad. Wait, these videos are two years old. I'm getting asked for these now. Really? Yeah. I've never heard of this until, like, last month. 
Maybe you're you getting didn't targeted know. ads. Oh, really? You didn't know about Dare Day for the... No, wow. but I just keep getting ads for the tree slide, and I got one for Coachella and one oh, other one. We're going to listen to the tree slide after this. That's uh, going to be so, so fun. I'm bringing Peter out for that. Peter Riddle. definitely knows <clears throat> Dare Day. Man, I just want to, like, be fucking wholesome right now, but thanks so much for doing this, Quinn. This hey, is, like, this has added so much entertainment to doing this. Yeah. Even, even if this doesn't, like... I'm not even going to say anything about that. No, this is way more entertaining. What are you yeah. typing in right now? <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen this? <laughs> you got to zoom in on it. I think no, if you like do two fingers, dude, like you're zooming in on an iPhone. Choose reward mechanism. <laughs> you got me fucked up. <laughs> Risk screen That's chair. us. He's making fun of us. <laughs> oh, fuck. Wait, that's us? Yeah, it, the intern is already shitting on us. I like on that. On our bro. own podcast. Is that an iPad case? Yeah. That's an iPad oh, fuck case. Oh, you get already. fucked. You got an ad. Yeah. Well, you're, turning me, you're turning me negative right now, Quinn. Yeah. Dude, that's nuts. Yeah. Reward. Juice reward mechanism. Response bar. Stim- so you're... Wouldn't that be you? Yeah, you're typing restra- on that? I don't that? have a restraint chair. <laughs> Well, like, do you feel, that could get do you, range. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're already in there. Try and get yourself out of this building. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look around. Um, like this. Response bar, <laughs> stimulus screen. <laughs> you see how quickly he picked that up? Like, immediately after I was getting wholesome and thanking him, he's just like, yeah. Huh. You guys are just Anyways, dumb monkeys. Like machine that. Monkey yeah, fun, whatever. <clears throat> Darren, Darren Day, good luck. Names. Yeah, good luck for Darren, brother. Um, I went out to, I'm going to shout out this restaurant. I went to the local pretty recently, and I went to the bathroom. And I guess they only have, they got one urinal. First of all, the bathroom is not big whatsoever. It's like a well, five. The local's not that big. F- no. They got like a five by five bathroom. And they've got one stall. And it's like as soon as you open the, up the door, you're staring at the stall. And then to your left is um, the urinal. And then in between that is the sink. Small ass room. Oh, really? I walk in and I basically bump this guy's back with the door trying to open it up. And he's standing there six feet away from the toilet, full on stream into the toilet. I know who this was, I think. The three point. You know who this was? I think so. I don't know who this was. <laughs> Somebody was telling me about something like this. No. I think it might be I think it might be one of my coworkers. Was there a guy at the urinal? He was telling me about it, about how he was like, he's like, I want to see how far back I can go on this John. It might just be a crazy coincidence, and it might not be him, and it might have been some other crazy time. But no, this this motherfucker definitely said some shit about it. Too. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> doing this. Yeah. This is absurd. Oh, no way. Yeah, okay. I see why you're writing notes down. Keep writing those notes like about that. what you're typing in, because then I can, I actually know what we're looking at. Yeah. yeah. No way. Yeah, it might be. It might be. It might not be. It's a pretty small town, though. It might be the same guy. <laughs> There's no stall door on the bathroom. Yeah, he doesn't give a fuck. No. You walk into the bathroom. You see the toilet. There's no stall door. Yeah. So you just sit there, and you can stare at the guys opening the door. Well, anyways, I open the door, and yeah, he's seen how far he can. he's hitting the toilet. It's getting in. Mm. And I bump the door. I'm like, oh, sorry. I'm looking at him. I'm like, actually, I take that back. What the fuck? I'm like, are you trying to? Get it in the toilet, and he just looked around. He just like gave me a big thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> I look at the guy. You know the urinals, hammered. Oh, he's just fucking. I'm like, can you get a, little, get a load of this guy? He's like, yeah, can't bring him anywhere. I'm like, <laughs> ew, <laughs> ew, what a sick I joke. have to use this bathroom. You forty year old. So I'm standing there, anywhere. and and of course I can't stand anywhere because people are gonna open the door, or I stand in the way of this guy's like. T- stream mm-hmm. or I'm standing at the urinal so I'm just waiting and then we all do like musical chairs as we're switching positions now I'm standing in the stall as guy's washing his hand and he leaves yeah. I go use the urinal and I'm I'll, I'm alone in the urinal I'm like mm-hmm. what the hell just happened yeah dude so you said you said there was who the fuck is that um you said there wasn't um there wasn't a, like a door on the urine or on the stall no right? no I don't know if you'll remember this because you didn't go to Esquimalt, but there was a time I did in, one year. in my tenure. Well, you you might not actually either then, because yeah, I just remembered that there was a time. No shit, I don't know how the fuck this happened, but all I know is that on the third floor, one year, somebody decided that they were gonna take the fucking door off of the the stall, so there just wasn't a door on the stall. I don't know how you fu- you're on the third floor, dude. There's no good way to get down. There's one main staircase. Yeah. 
So he, I guess he fucking brought it because it wasn't in the bathroom. But somebody just decided to steal one of the doors. Oh, sorry, they left it in the main staircase? No, I don't know where the fuck it is. It was just gone. Oh. So somebody stole the fucking door to one of the, the stalls at, at the Mesquite Mall. That's so tough. Yeah. What a fucking joke, dude. What a fucking school. It reminds me of the, uh, what was it, the devious lick challenge? Yeah, 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 dude, totally. It, it's probably totally. what that was. It's probably what that was. Um, my buddy Robert, this is the second time I've done Shout out, Robert. I hope you're doing good, man. Um, he, uh, by the way, when you got a second, you see if the camera's still recording. Um, he left his high school with his locker. So remember when I was talking about that story where we're in the man cave and there's no windows, you could like wake up at like. Oh yeah, you just don't know where the fuck. Yeah, that yeah, is. yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's yeah. got his school locker in there, and I think we actually maybe it's just in passing. Maybe I've heard the story from someone else, but I think we have a buddy who stole his entire desk. Like it was one of those desks that have the connector. What? Like the connector desks? Yeah, like you're sitting on the chair and the desk is connected. Yeah, 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 that that. <laughs> John. Fucker, how how do you do the that? fuck do you do that? First of all, you don't have access to a truck in high school. Yeah. You barely can drive until the end of high school. Dude, actually, <laughs> speaking of that, we, we had we had all the access uh, to a truck during high school. <laughs> thanks, who's, thanks, who's to to fucking, thanks to fucking Nick. Oh, Nick. No shit. Yeah. Nick, had a, Nick had a truck. I'm going to fucking out you. Nick had a truck um, in the high Nick school. Episode. I think it was a Mazda, maybe. Yeah, like a B300 like, or something. Yeah, or something like that. And we, um, Nick, uh, I don't know why, but there was a fucking... There's like a like a secondary like a backup key on the fucking vehicle. He had one of those like magnets that like stuck underneath. Yeah. So we would just like, at like I'm sure I I hope Nick knows about this, but I'm sure he does. Um, <laughs> he but we would just like know. we would leave like fucking like early first block before our like actual designated break. Yeah. And we would just leave and we would take Nick's truck, like we would take the spare key, take Nick's truck, go to Timmy's or some shit. <clears throat> and then just come back and just like just just hang out with Nick by his truck and we're like Nah, we just stole your fucking truck. So that uh, that definitely happened. Dude, I had a key like that on my car for the longest time. It was the same thing, but <clears throat> I when I first got the car it was an Oldsmobile Lero and it was front wheel drive. I had too big of an engine for the car and it came it was just like way too fast. Yeah. I say that jokingly, but I don't know. Like in high school, it felt pretty fast. It wasn't no souped up Honda Civic, but I would take that thing and I would just like e-brake drift that f everywhere. Yeah. There's one day out in the snow, I was rolling and I drifted, lost control, tried to steer back into it, and like went to the ditch and hit a log. But the log was so dead mm -hmm. and so filled with water that as soon as I hit it, it just kind of like exploded. It just like, evaporated. Yeah, and deleted my fog light. So that when you look at the car, there's like two. On the front bumper, there's two low lights. Mm -hmm. One light was just missing, and the other light was the fog light. Yeah. But if you suck your hand up in the missing one, there is the frame of the front bumper. That's yeah. where I stuck my key. Oh. So it would be a sick party trick where I would just give people my key, or I'd throw my key somewhere and be like, oh, no, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'd turn on my car and leave. <laughs> but the other best part about that was the key <laughs> slide. <laughs> the, uh, the car also didn't require the key to be in the vehicle while driving so i did this all the time when i was like driving with friends or i was like trying to impress a girl or something we'd be like driving yeah exactly drive with a buddy on the highway and i would just like take the key out and be like ha, 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 throw the key right in the next vehicle jesus um and then <laughs> you just got actually spit roasted by the way um get <laughs> shit on that wasn't that wasn't meant to be a talk I, I, I love that <laughs> I love that. Most a lot. down bad thing you did to impress a girl? Question mark. No, that's that's a full on statement. Yeah. I wasn't saying that was. I was asking. <laughs> <laughs> He's asking oh, questions. You're these up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Trying to set up. No, no, that's fair. That's fair. Uh, so you that's well, set up and you both dunked on me at the yeah, same time. Absolutely pissed on, brother. Uh, yeah, fucked on my oh, own I podcast. Mean. That's okay. I knew I brought you on for a reason. Um, uh, damn, that th that got me swept. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What else was I say? Keegan. Our, my, our, uh, Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> our buddy Keegan had a truck and he, uh, uh, he, he had a truck. It was a Jeep Comanche that he got and it was kind of busted. It was standard, so of course you needed to press the clutch in and turn the vehicle on yeah. and the ignition like that. So I hopped in his truck 
He just got it, and I was mm -hmm. testing it out. And I sat in the truck. I looked at it. Now, on older vehicles, the ignition will have – the key will slide in, and it will slide in, like, through these two wings. Like, it looks like a wing nut. Mm -hmm. So you can grab the two – like, your key is in the ignition. Yeah. And normally, you have to twist the key. But you can just put your thumb and your front finger on these two wings yeah. and spin the ignition like that. So I've been in old, old vehicles before where I, those sometimes just spin freely because they're broken. So I just, like, I'm putting my foot on the clutch. Keegan has the keys in his hand, and I grab the ignition, and I just turn it on without the key. <laughs> I, look at, I look at him dead in the eye. I'm like, dude, this could be an issue. Yeah. I don't know if you know that. And he's like, I didn't even know that. I didn't even know that could work. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, it fuck. Absolutely rolled. Yeah. Um, and then I got another truck. All right, sorry. I got a truck after... Uh, I give that car to my sister because they were they were my uncle's like like word trucks and like he they were like run through the business so yeah. he, he was just letting me borrow it he let a lot of people borrow him and I got in the truck when he gave it to me and we were just sitting there and the first thing I do was turn the truck on and I take the key out wow. as it's running and he's yeah. like he's like oh yeah it does that and like that's perfect that it does that because it did it with the other vehicle you gave me too and he's like he starts laughing he's like oh, fuck I guess we got a little trend going on here. yeah literally now I miss that I drive every vehicle and they're just like he's stuck in the yeah. he's stuck in the ignition yeah. fuck what are you gonna do what are you gonna do yeah, if you need to use your keys yeah yeah you just fucked <laughs> shit on. bluetooth keys yeah um, oh, this is adding such a big variable into my talking points. I kind of fuck with it. I do too. Keep me on my toes. I mean, I hope it's helping. I don't know. Dude, no, I it's think how it's you're helping. I you're think so, good. Am I going to raise? Oh, maybe. Dude. What's zero times two? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what you're making, man. <laughs> That's what I'm making, man. Yeah. Now I'm more comfortable with dead air, too, because I can just cut it out. Yeah. Let's see. Do I have any other talking points? I wonder if you. Yeah, I guess you can access my notes from my phone. Well, that's the thing, though. You guys, you guys are just, like, cutting and, like, clipping. Very, shit. very rarely. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, usually it's just a full-on shoot. Yeah, usually he just listens to it, and he's like... I just cut some yeah, random like, shit. We'll block out that, man. Like, we usually do, like, an hour and ten, hour and fifteen. I'll probably cut out, like, four minutes of it. Shit. Yeah. yeah. Normally it's pretty good. Like, we don't... We rarely ever have dead air. We just talk. Yeah. I was gonna say, if you guys want me to just, like... Throw them random ideas every once in a while. Just put them That's what I'm saying. Just yeah, do whatever you, do, you want to do. whatever do. you yeah. feel necessary, well, brother. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, just, dude, this is what's going to happen to you in every co-op. You're just going to be in there, and especially in software engineering, or at least from what I've heard, they're just going to be like, okay, so we got deadlines to meet, so just work just and see it. if you can get it done. Yeah. Do stuff, yeah, Good. basically. Um, oh, I got a, I got a story. I kind of want to bring on my cousin for this but i can't because he's living in ontario uh, this dude shame Callum, shout out what a legend he goes to he went to i think it was philadelphia or pittsburgh i forget which one but he had to go do um some on-site um electrical sort of upgrades to the vehicle like this company bought um I guess a vehicle from the company, and then he has to go and set things up on site. Yeah. So he's down in, oh, fuck, what was it? I think it's Pittsburgh. Uh, whatever it regards. Um, so he is down there, and they they work like eight hours a day. But then he has like free time after work to do it. He's only there for a week. Yeah. So him and his, him and his, oh, fuck, I really want him to tell this story, but I, I'll, I'll just tell it. He goes out after work and. They don't have vehicle. Well, they have a vehicle down there, but it's the city. So they just rent those scooters, those bird scooters right. that you can hop on. Yeah. And uh, just kind of fuck around, go check out the city. And he's with this guy. He's like 40 years. I think his co is like 40 years old. Hops on with like sandals and shorts. Yeah. Callum's my age. Or Callum's like 24 or something. And he's like, dude, you're going to get fucked up. Yeah, these things, the Lime electric scooters. So he's like, dude, you're going to get fucked up when you're riding these things. What if you crash? You're wearing sandals. You're wearing shorts. By the way, people in Victoria ride on the fucking roads. They're, I'm riding behind people. These things go like 50 kilometers an hour. We don't have the rentable ones. Yeah. Oh, no. People buy them. Yeah. We don't have the rentable. You know, you're never going to be able to get rentable ones here. So they're renting these scooters, and, and they come up. Oh, what was happening? They're riding like the shoulder of a sidewalk. They don't. I don't think they have bike lanes there, but they've got like a little bit of a lane between. Yeah. And he's dogging on his coworker. He's like, "Dude, you're gonna get hit. Like, what happens if you fall? No helmets, no knee pads. Like, because yeah. you're not gonna lose her. You're yeah. just gonna ride." Yeah. 
and as basically as Callum's saying that, he's coming up to this. They're like there's alleyways like in bigger cities. There's alleyways. We don't really have alleyways here. We got like three of them, and yeah. I can like name them all. Yeah. Um, so he's coming up to this alleyway, and as he's coming up to the entrance of it, this old this old woman pulls out in her Maserati like SUV or, mm-hmm. or car, and like just keeps going. Yeah. Doesn't even see anyone. Doesn't stop. Or she pulls out too far. So that she's in, she's on the road. But Callum is like just about to connect with her. Pulls out. Callum hits the car. Goes like ass over tea kettle over the hood. No way. Fucks this woman's at Maserati up. Yeah. Hits the ground. Fucking gets up. And his buddy's like, oh, dude, are you okay? And he's like, yeah, yeah, man. I didn't hit my head. He like rolled off it. But he like pulled his hand up. And his thumb or his pinky was like going one direction. Moved over like two inches. And then kept going that same direction. Ugh. Fuck. So he sent me that shit, and he's like, dude, check this out. I'm like, what the hell happened to you? Yeah, what the fuck? I just got hit by a car, or technically, he hit a car. <laughs> yeah. He's in the States, though. And he's like, fuck, like, what's the, what are the hospitals like down here? Am I have to pay a bunch of money? Yeah. I think he's, like, through his benefits, so thankfully, he didn't. I don't think he had to pay much or even anything. But hospitals over in the States, it took him 45 minutes to get an x-ray, get his, and the doctor looked at the x-ray, and he's like, oh, dude, you're fine. Just, I, you can either wait here for a bit, we can, like medically you know break your finger get back into it or literally right now just give me your pinky and he's like well i gotta go to work tomorrow yeah here's my pinky so the doctor just put it back in just dislocated didn't break it it's not yeah didn't yeah it didn't break it you're a lucky guy so 45 minutes he was in and out had a stint on i called him i'm like hey dude how's your day sorry he showed me the picture after so i just called him like hey man what's going on they had a little conversation he's like yeah dude today was pretty crazy I actually just got hit by a car. Yeah, what a good thing. So then he told me the entire story. He sent me the photo. In the middle of the story, he sends me the photo. I'm like, oh, shit, that looks horrible. He's like, yeah, I'm all right, though. (laughs) Just got hit by a car. Hit this woman's Maserati. I don't think he has insurance. I don't think she has, like, I I don't think he has to pay anything. I think she just got fucked because she, well, she should have got fucked. Like That was a stupid idea. Yeah. But these bird scooters, man. Damn, or Lime scooters. So people are riding around Victoria with them, and they're going like, god damn, like 50 kilometers an hour, and uh, and they're driving in the lane that I'm driving. Mm-hmm. If you're, if you ever been on a, like, like a scooter going that fast, like we're talking like like skateboard speed wobbles. <laughs> we, I mean, yeah, we did it for a little bit. We kind of cooked, but. Where? When? When we were in Ont- or in Alberta. Oh, you rented the scooters? Yeah. Oh. We went from uh, some fucking place downtown to like one of the, the tower or whatever. Damn. Yeah. What was the fun? It was pretty fun. Okay. It was, it was, it was a little bit draw. shitty. It was a little bit shitty because um, we couldn't get we couldn't get somebody's vehicle to work because there was there was bikes and scooters. Yeah. So like, so like I think Peter had a bike or some shit, but we couldn't we couldn't figure out. Um, how to like, like one of them just was fucking up, but no, it was fun. It, it, they fucking rip, like it's yeah. There's no reason you should be going like 50 kilometers, no, especially not <laughs> dude on a scooter, no helmet. Yeah. I swear to God, these people are running like first of all, when you write riding motorcycles, the biggest joke with that is like people. I think they they they're called squids or like we know one. Yeah. Um, <laughs> they they don't ride with any gear. Yeah, but like they ride with a hoodie, maybe like some proper shoes yeah. and jeans like you're not really gonna get a road rash unit there's guys that ride in like flip flops and oh, I've like seen them. shorts I've seen them downtown, yeah right? and you're like, what are you doing? so that's one step I don't know if that's safer than riding a scooter because you can go faster but a scooter it feels like there's just that level of confidence that you just don't need to get on yeah. that yeah that's freaky dude I um I don't know if I ever thought like just speaking on like near like car accidents or some shit um, I don't know if I've ever talked about this, but I was I was in a bus like a while ago. Maybe I talked about this. This happened. This, another incident happened in the bus the other day. Uh, but this one this one was a long time or, or like a while ago, and um, I was coming off the Johnson Street Bridge. Okay. Yeah. And yeah. it gets kind of fucky there because of the bike lanes. Yeah. Like it's like bike lanes are just kind of like weirdly like placed yeah. where they shouldn't be. Um, and we were in the bus and we were just kind of cruising. And then there was this bike who was cruising up beside us. And I guess thought that, like, literally on the turn to wharf. Like, literally just right oh, off the thing. you're getting into downtown. Yeah, like, we were getting, we were <clears> there. Yeah, that area sucks. Yeah, and fucking, like, so we're, like, we're taking this corner. And, I mean, it's, like, 
bus is in a fucking normal lane anyways. It's like already too big. And this, this bus driver like, like takes the turn and, um, there's a fucking bicyclist like pulling up beside us. And I guess like, well, I mean, I don't know, like, let's just get a grip both fucking sides of it. Like, let's just fucking whatever. Uh, but the bicyclist just like decided to like alpha and like try to like ego go through and he just like got halfway through. I'm standing at the fucking door and I'm looking out the door and I see this dude pull up and he's right in front of me now. Cause it turns on to the same road that the bike. Yeah. Pe- it's like, it's, it's just like, it's a shitty little like 20 foot stretch. Um, but we like fucking, we like turn onto it and then fucking the bike just like chills there instead of like fucking like, like slowing down or like trying to rip past. Yeah. He just like matches speed. And then we just like keep turning. But the bike's not turning. But the bike's like just, it's, well, we're like turning. So we have to like cut off like the lane because we're bigger than the fucking yeah. lane. So you just like, I just see this bike just like smash into the side of the bus and he just like fucking flips over. <laughs> and the bus driver just like keeps going. The bus driver's like, fuck it, anyways. And he has to like stop like immediately after the turn. Just stops. Just like keeps fucking going. And I'm like, motherfucker, definitely just like it completely hit a fucking pedestrian. But I was like, ah, whatever, dude. <laughs> it's literally your fault, dude. Like, so it has no. Did someone ask to stop at that bus stop and he just kept driving? Yeah. No, no, like they stopped at the bus stop and he yeah. stopped at the bus stop. Yeah, yeah. But it was like 20 feet before this, he had hit this person. And this person was like out of commission, just like sitting down, <laughs> taking a little breather. But I was like, what the fuck is happening? There was like people on the bus, like classic fucking like. Just classic people. They're like, <gasps> oh my I was God. like, dude, get a grip. It's literally both people's fault. It doesn't matter. They're all fucking stupid. Dude, I, fuck, man. Like, you gotta be able to, you gotta understand. Like, that's why there's certain, okay, wait. Okay, we got we got Russian dash cams on right now. I'm getting I'm getting distracted. Sorry, I thought it was uh, inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> no, I thought you were good. Um, um, uh, that person, by the way, just got cooked by motorcyclists. <laughs> I don't think we can have this on. <laughs> I kind of can't show this. Probably not. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, dude. There's fucking a certain level of of understanding that you should have when you're riding a god like a bike, and you're riding with vehicles. First of all, you know when you have when there's a uh, intersection but the, tur- the left turn lane is further back than the, the other lanes yeah you stay there you stay for a there. reason it's because of vehicles that'll take a big wide turn yeah there's pinch points it has there's to, different yeah. t- there it's just not physically possible for a bus to make a turn it it's literally a big straight line yeah and you can't have a straight line curve around something because yeah. it crosses over yeah so when you're a bicyclist and you're or a cyclist and you're riding against not against with a bus and it starts to turn it turns for the year it's not giving you a curb you're or done a curve it's not a race line yeah you're done you're like you just you already fucked up i i wouldn't have stopped either no dude fuck no man it was just it was actually like the dumbest shit ever but yeah cyclist audacity that's perfect <laughs> <laughs> but um exactly no for sure uh but it's like <clears throat> no it's just whack dude it's like what the fuck no. This city has given too much leeway for me. Yeah. But I think, th- dude, there's like a fucking, I mean, as far as I'm concerned, it, as soon as you... Oh, this is perfect. Keep going. Sorry. Whether you do like a motorcyclist or a bicyclist, that you you know instantly that there's like an inherent danger. You are now at more at a risk. Yeah. So you have to be more responsible. Yeah. Regardless of, I don't give a fuck if it's the bus driver's fault in this case, but like you need to be more responsible because you going, uh, you going up against the bus, you yep. just lose. There's no winning that. No, so you have to be fucking on. Oh, your you shit. got a fucking helmet. Yeah, like good. Congrats. Your ankle's broken still. You fucking idiot. <laughs> yeah, now you can't go to work. Um, Nor can you ride a bike. Exactly, but like you, you know, drive what I mean? like, a car though. You just have to like. You just have to have that like in the back of your head of like. Well, I have to be more cautious. Yeah. Because, they like, it just sucks. But. Yeah, man. I I don't understand it. Like, uh, there's so much just like. <clears throat> What's the word? It starts with E. Entitlement. Yes. There's so much entitlement. For sure. Uh, So this actually works perfect into something I wanted to bitch and rant about. All right, small town rant. Here we go. Let's go. Tilikum Road, man. Okay. You remember Tilikum Road as two lane on each side, right? Yeah. That goes from... Like the one in front of the mall. Right in front of the mall. And it goes from in front of the mall to basically the intersection of the highway. Yeah, yeah. So now, from the Gorge Bridge... Yeah. To pass the mall, or, yeah, no, to the mall, mm-hmm. it, no way there's Tilcom Road memes. There are. Yeah, man. Sorry. 
Yeah, first of all, till come is spelled till I come. Classic. Such a funny fucking. You have first to love of all, it. that's yeah. I think it's because of the Tilcom whale. That's a whale species. Tilcom or a whale named. Regardless, so Tilcom Road used to be two ro- two um, two lanes wide on each side. That road at four is a, is basically a service road for people coming to Esquimalt, leaving Esquimalt, and everywhere in between. That road gets busy well yeah on on like on high capacity times like getting off to getting off work going to work yeah yeah. so then they now and first of all when you're on that stretch that's in between like that small small strip mall and tilikum mall yeah there are like three side streets that people take up one lane and turn they try and turn left left and they got to wait for the entire other side of the oncoming to stop driving takes forever yeah so now what they did is they added a turning lane. No. They took out, they added bike lanes. Yeah. They took out, so now it's one lane both ways with merges from like the Tilka Mall and from like the Gorge area. What are we doing? So dude? now in order to help how, how long it's like the traffic jam, they bottleneck it down to one lane. Yeah. There's turning lanes to help you turn onto the small side streets Good. that you're never going to be able to turn off of because we bottlenecked the rest of the fucking road yeah (laughs) what the fuck are we doing i'm saying i'm swearing too much but i'm pissed because that road would be so nice when you're driving to work i drove to work for like a year doing that i worked on this one job site that was on till or basically on the end of tilikum yeah and the left like the inside lanes sorry the outside lanes just like a highway people would go slow or people are trying to turn so you can easily time and not have to wait behind people. Yeah. I mean, technically, you still don't because there's specific turning lanes. Yeah. But now, if someone's going slow in the right lane, you you can't speed in the left lane. Yeah. Not that I ever speed. Um, yeah. But you can't like race through that anymore. Yeah. It's madness. It, this city is going to shit. Yeah. Civil, I say that civil engineers need to get a grip. I don't even know if it's a civil engineer doing any of this. I think it's just like. I can't read behind the camera. I see. Jack doesn't fun. speed, by the way. <laughs> um, <laughs> No, yeah, I just I don't get this it. This place sucks, man. I was talking about it actually last night with one of my coworkers, and it's like, it, it, you can walk parts of downtown, like. Um, oh yeah, but there's no cars that drive through the. Sure, street, but you can like yeah. walk. You can walk around there, and you just like you just look, and you're like, we're trying so hard to be like a big city, but we can't. But we, we just don't have the room. No. Like, where are you gonna push it? No. Like, you just can't. It, it's impossible. But we're just like, oh, we gotta put fucking skyscrapers up everywhere. We're like, we yeah. need, we need these fucking buildings. Yeah. yeah. And I'm like, no, we don't have this shit, bro. We don't have the, the capacity for this shit. Apparently, Victoria is a huge, huge part of the tech. Um, what the hell? Um, the tech shit. Yeah, like technology. Like that's why we have all these skyscrapers because tech companies are moving in. Like a lot of tech innovation is coming out of Victoria. Yeah. Not like Silicon Valley type shit, but. Like well, no. the comparative, like, like we had we had Bill Gates over here. Yeah, he Bill Gates likes to park his, his big ass yacht in yeah. uh, the Victoria Harbor. Well, because we have like a win, we have a um, a Windows. Yeah, we have like a Windows. Microsoft or Microsoft, <laughs> whatever, dude. <laughs> we have a App, Apple to the day I die, bro. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> um, what's, what's, your, what's your what's your uh, desktop? Yeah. Um, <laughs> Is it Microsoft? It's it's keep saying activate Windows and I won't because <laughs> Wait, it still doesn't even pay for Windows. <laughs> yeah, fuck that, brother. I'm not paying for Windows. Um, no, but <coughs> we just got like we gotta get a grip. Uh, like we're not big town. If you want to go to a big town, just go to Vancouver. That's like your best bet. I think I might have talked about this actually. Homeless antics brought that up to me. I I guarantee I've probably talked about this because it was the most monumental thing that had happened to me. Um, because I always have run-ins with, with homeless people or just, like, random shit like that. Like, just random downtown people. Um, but this time I was walking I was walking a little bit downtown before, like, I was scheduled to start work. Like, I had to go, to like, I don't know, I had to go buy some random shit before I got to work. Um, and I'm, like, walking in the street and, like, I'm, like, listening to music, but, like, I can still, like, hear shit and I'm, like, just vibing. And um, I see this fucking absolute alpha just start walking and he's just like this fucking like five five disheveled man yeah and i was like oh okay cool like he's obviously pooking on whatever the fuck he's doing but i'm like but i'm like okay like whatever 
And I'm hearing, hearing him, like, screaming at, like, people. And I'm like, ah, well, good. Fuck it up, dude. And then he gets to me. Like, he's walking past me. We're walking at each other. And he gets to me. And he just looks at me in the most alien way. And just says, move, mortal. And I was like... <laughs> <laughs> I've never, you, you, you've never been humbled that hard in your entire life. Until Move some, more And time. I was like, you are... Uh, okay, yep. My bad, dude. My apologies. I'll Just keep the, going. I'll get the fuck out of the way. Whatever, you're, whatever mission you're on, bro, whatever side quest you got going yeah. on right now, you need to go. <laughs> and you got that. Yeah. Move mortal. Yeah, you know what that You know what that was? Yeah. That was when you beat a game. You're like level he's walking, 70. He's walking around max level. Yeah, there's a level 2 walking. You're like... Yeah. Up... <laughs> No, sorry. Dude. Your game. My, my they, dude, I, didn't say, I didn't mean to say that. You didn't say anything. Yeah. The confidence <laughs> that they fucking... mortal. The, the confidence that they have is fucking absurd. Like, I'm not a small man by any means. And this kid was very small. Yeah, how tall are you? You're like six... I'm like six foot. Six... But, oh, no, I'm six feet tall. Uh, you were the same height. Uh, I mean, you, know, you want to talk about it? I'm going to shit on for that you're one. You're six foot. Yeah, 5'11". No, and I don't, give a, no, and I don't like give a fuck what anybody says you're six quarters. foot. Because me and you were the same height. That's, that's real shit. You Anyways, hear that. Um, but no, like I'm not a small person, and I'm like big too. Like not like gym big, but like I'm just a, a big person. So um, like the fact that like you have that kind of confidence, um, the fact that you have that level of confidence blows my mind. Yeah, but I think it's like it's obviously like blind confidence. Like you're just like absolutely gooned, and you're just like, well, yeah. Because what if you just the like fuck out of my way? Could you have lifted him? Yes. Back then, this was a long. This was many months ago, before I even looked at a gym, and Move I could have fucking more thrown at him. And I was like, dude, what? But I was like, you know what, dude? My, my, my fucking bad. bad. I didn't my bad, you. dude. I'm never walking this street at that time again because this is yours. <laughs> Move, mortal. Move, mortal. What a what a legend. Fuck. It's insane, dude. There's there's sometimes that I'm walking down the street and like normally t- normally I'm walking around downtown like during like day hours, but night hours, anything past two a.m. Shit's just different. Mm. There's just so many times I want to say random shit to people. It was, but like yeah, now, it time. move more tall. That's, that's all it was. And, I was like, well, and see, the thing is, is I couldn't say that because if I, yeah, see, I don't have crackhead confidence. Yeah, I'm not able to do that. No, it's 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 impossible for somebody like you to do that. Um, no, dude, I am. Um, move. I, more I, was, I can't fucking get off. No, it was brutal. It, like it, it, it still rocks me to this day. I think yeah, about I would've gotten on the bus and just like. Yeah, headphones I'm out like, I'm like walking to work too and I'm like scared oh, this it's like was fucking during... 2 o'clock in the, it's like 2 o'clock in the this afternoon this wasn't at night no it's like 2 o'clock in the afternoon bro it's midday and I'm like man brother it ruined my whole day yeah you're supposed to think about that for the rest yeah, of the and day I'm like, I gotta go like, just like I'm sorry you're, yeah, you're I fucking chef, suck at chef's yelling at you Wait, you're yeah, like, like, like dude anything you say please. to me doesn't matter yeah I'm like, I just got alpha by a fucking 5-5 five, five no by some crackhead <laughs> I uh, I got told this story one time. I, I wasn't there for it, but um, my 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 coworker JC, shout out JC. Um, That's like the eighth shout out of this yeah, episode. Yeah, but um, he. Um, <sighs> but so he um, <laughs> he was talking about like, he 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 had gone out to dinner with um, his girlfriend or his fiance now. Um, Let's go. Yep, claps up for that. But um, at the time, his girlfriend and he um, they were walking around and and. Um, like they got dinner or whatever, and then they like they were walking back to his car. And he has like a pretty nice car. He has like a Dodge Charger, like a, like a twenty eighteen. Oh, okay, so cool. Like pretty nice yeah. car. Um, and um, so he like he's walking up to his car and he sees that there's there's a dude by his car, and he's like poking and fucking screaming and just downtown antics. And um, randomly, I, I don't know if he like fucking like God mode spawns this bike out of nowhere, but he like. Picks up this fucking bike out of nowhere, right in front of did my buddy's car. Did you spawned this yeah, bike? Yeah, I did. Well, because... A little bit up, up, down, the, down, left, yeah, right, where X, the fuck is this bike coming from? You got the Sanchez that popped Yeah, there. and so he, like, picks up this fucking bike, and my buddy's just like, well, I don't want to have to fucking kill you, but if you drop that shit on my fucking car, I'm going to murder you. Yeah. And he, like, fucking, like, he's like... It, like holding it like a fucking like a one of those like tra- pull up Travis yeah, Scott Travis, on the stage Travis is that what Scott. you were thinking of? literally fucking just holding it like above his head and then so he's like fucking 30 feet back still and he's just watching this <laughs> literally like this like he's holding he's holding the bike above his head and then he just 
places the bike on his car. <gasps> like, as, as gently as a crackhead could do. Is this a real picture? What's up with this mouth in this picture? Yeah, but that's, that's a real that's, picture. That's, that's a real photo. But, no, he just places his bike. See if you can look at the video. He places his bike on my buddy's car. Yeah. And my buddy was fucking furious. <laughs> Dude, yeah. Big time giffer right there. Um, but, yeah, I mean, obviously he didn't kill him because the cracker just, like, ran away, scurried off. Yes. But he just, like, he, like, walked through his car, just, like, picked up a bike off his car. He's like, what? It was a bicycle? It was, like, a bicycle, and yeah. He, what, he laid it flat? And he just, like, he, I, I don't know put how, but he just, like, he just, kickstand like, down. He just, like, put it on his car. And he's like, fuck this. And he, like, drove home. He told me about it. I died laughing. I was like, I can't even fucking. Was there scratches on the car? I don't think so. God damn, man. Yeah, but I was like, dude, what an actual legend. Fuck. Running into Travis Scott at 3 a.m. gone yeah, wrong. Just fucking going bike, crazy. Bike in hand. Yeah. What the hell, man? Yeah. I was yeah. Like, what dude, the fuck? it's kind of like. It's kind of like the two situations where you have, like, a dog, and the dog obviously has, like, something important in, your, in its mouth. And oh, you're, yeah. So you're just like. You're like, I have to calm down because if I even fucking spark this bitch up, he's just going to run. Don't yeah. get excited. Yeah. Take that out of your mouth. Yeah. We're just going to walk. And then you say the word walk and the dog freaks the fuck out and you're like, no, no, no. Fuck. Yeah. There you go. Gone. Yeah. Your shoes ripped. You yeah. Know, your Balenci's ripped in yeah, half. My Balenci's. Or like you get a kid. The kid's like, you come home. The kid's like three years old, already on top of the fridge, about to do like a WWE move. Yeah. You're like. Okay. Yeah, you're like, what the fuck? Not today. Yeah. Let's just relax. Babysitting nightmares. You ever see the video of the kid? Oh, fuck. There's a video. And there's a kid that's just like jumped off the front of... See if you can look up kid jumps off TV stand. And he jumps off this TV stand and... Yeah, there it is. There it is. Off Facebook video. Huh? What the fuck? Watch this kid. Dude, am I... <laughs> He's no, fine. no way, brother. This is my kid when I have one. Oh, he's got glasses on too. Oh, and brother. they wrap around his head. Oh no. Oh man, see if you can like uh, copy this link and then throw it in the notes. He got them. Well, I've just been leaving tabs open. Mode. Yeah. Oh yeah, that works. Oh, that, I can that do works that. Really I can well. do that after though. Um. Damn, man. Yeah, that type of like kid energy like that, and you come home, and you're like, brother, okay. I can't. I couldn't. Just a stone. I mean, you watched the dog last night. Dude, yeah, and I, I, got, I have no fucking problem with, with dogs and having shit in their mouth. Like, a lot of people are like, hey, the fucking dogs are, dogs are all fucking Maybe. messy and shit. The dog, we were walking him, and then the dog, like, um, the dog picked up, like, an acorn or some shit. Yeah. And I was like, brother, drop that shit. It's not fucking food. Like, get it out of your mouth. And he just, like, looked at me. Just kept crunching it, and I was like, "Yeah, fuck off!" Yeah. And I grabbed his fucking face and just shoved my hand in it and just like raked it all out. And I was like, "Stop eating the, stop eating the milk!" Yeah, like literally, don't. It was a rock. No, it was a fucking like an acorn. Oh, and an I was acorn. Like, Get it out yeah. here, bro! Like, stop eating that shit. Yeah, but no. <laughs> dude, it was fucking those videos get me. I, my mind's going a mile a minute. Those videos of like, you ever see the dog? It was like, um. This kid has his dog, and the dog's sitting there, like, mouth wide open, just breathing. Yeah. And the kid's like, get the fuck out of here, and sticks his hand in the yes, mouth. Yeah, dude. I, have you seen this? That was my favorite. No get, 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 get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Dude, I like this. I'm like, do you care that I'm, like, pointing at you when I'm, when I'm doing yeah, this shit? If you ever need to check his gangster, tell him. I'm tell him a person. Stuff. It's okay. Yeah, this, I'm dude. here. <laughs> ah, get the fuck out of here. And he's just like, yeah, I'll, 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 I'll be. <laughs> Yo, replay it. What a classic meme. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I, love, I love the oh, noise that makes, man. That's a good time. The dog's in there. Dude, my dog does it all the time. Yeah. She's like in a chocolate lab at home and she'll just sit there. She'll like come and like crawl on top of me. She's like 60 pounds. I'm like, dude, I can't breathe when you're on me, dude. Yeah. So then her mouth like opens up when she goes to yawn. I just stick my fist in there. I'm like, and what? Get shit on. What are you going to do? Yeah. Reminds me of this but that's thing. the thing, man. It's like, there's one day. There is one day that your dog is just going to look at you and realize you're made of meat. Yeah. And it's just going to... I, I pray for that day. Wait, we had that happen? Dude, were you there for this conversation? I don't think you were. Pete, one day, Peter's dad, shout out him. Um, he, um... <laughs> Peter's, Peter's dad came in. I don't know what the fuck he was on. Like, I don't know what like he was frozen doing. Cat. Frozen cat. I don't know what he was doing, but he, like... Yeah, look at the frozen cat. Why the fuck this cat from? I'm sorry. I don't know what he was like, uh, what he was doing, but it was like late at night, and Pete just like walks into Peter's room, and he's like, 
Would you rather get? <laughs> Shit, this isn't. That's not it. That's it. Holy like, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck! That's not it. Jesus! My cat has it. My cat frozen fucks. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, oh, what? You gotta hit that. Oh, it's a vine. No it's way. Vine. We're bringing back vines. Vines? Nope. Yeah, I get you. Damn it, man. Um, yeah, see me. See what you can do. Yeah, keep going. No, so yeah, so Peter, uh, Pete just walks into Peter's room and asks, um, if you like, what would you, what would you rather? If you, if you like, had to fight. A fucking cougar or a fucking wolf? Like, what would you, what would you, like an actual, Wait, like a asking real, me? yeah, well, this was like, this was the question that was posed to me and Peter. Yeah, okay. And I have my answers and, 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 um, I would like to hear your opinion. <coughs> Frozen in place. Just a fucking, um, yeah. Yeah, pause that shit. Sure. Brutal. Um, <laughs> but yeah. Sorry. This is the question. That <laughs> yeah, that's the question. Yeah. So, a cougar, like, if you had to fight, like, just one on one, no sneaky shit, just yeah. fucking. A face, cougar or a wolf? A cougar or like a real fucking wolf, like a fucking wolf. Dude, what would you? I call, fight? I do think about that sometimes. Yeah. Like animal. There is a right answer, by the way. And is it like based on technique of what you're fighting? Yeah. Would it not be wolf? Like that you would rather fight? I'd probably fight a wolf. Hundred percent, you're fighting a wolf. Yeah. And Pete, Pete brought up a really good point. Um, by the way, Peter, don't do anything about this. We're not fighting any animals. This is what you think about, right? You think about the cougars, our yeah. cats, obviously, and they have the claws on all four. Oh, does a wolf only have claws in the front too? Well, they're like they're like half-ass they're claws, half anyways, claws. right? Claws, yeah. So the fact of the matter is, if I if I Somehow, if I got in and grabbed a fucking cat, or I like, grabbed a cougar, yeah. by the fucking scruff, and like just try to like, hold him, it's fucking it. slicing me up. Open. It's just, blah, 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 right? But if I grab a fucking wolf, yeah. and if I'm fight or flight, like really like putting it all into me, yeah. I could hold him down, yeah. and if I'm on like just on top of him, put him down, and just hold him there, yeah. I guarantee I could do that way more than a fucking cougar. Well, this cougar was slicing too, It's going to use your mouth. It, it's mouth. Sure. So what do you do? Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> no but you you, <laughs> you grab him by the fucking jowls and you just put his ass down and you hold him there. That's Why the does that cougar look them. so like Why? he's so stoic? Yeah. Look at that. Look at that bottom left one. Cougar National Geographic. Dude, what? what? It's just, just like. Oh. <laughs> you don't you don't have to keep that in if you don't want it. I don't know what you. I don't know if I want it either. But <laughs> I said it. But that dude, I, that <laughs> I was thinking it. But I. Um, no, but like if it. If it Animal opens its mouth, like the first thing you do is just like stick your fist down it because it's gonna choke. And then you just start beaming it yeah. left, left hooks. Oh, sorry, but I didn't say that. Um, but mm. not good. Left um, hooks against a wolf, dude, it's it's life or death. No, but no, that's what I'm saying. It's 100% a wolf. Like, like, no matter what, like, you never ever would fight a cougar. No, I would never do that. You ever seen a cougar? Uh, no, but I heard a cougar. Yeah, scary shit right Bryce and I were camping up at his place before I lived up there. Yeah. Up in Yubo. And yeah. we were sitting in our oh, that's a good place to fucking find one. And uh, we heard, I think it was like a car screech, a car tire screech. First yeah. of all, that never happens. Not the car tire screech, but a, a cougar jumping in front of a car. I don't know if that's what happened. It sounded like that. Yeah. But this fucking shrill that it made, shriek, shrill, whatever, I think shrill is the right word. It hurt. Yeah. Inside. It's a like, scary fucking like, thing, bro. Holy fuck, what was that? It sounded like a um, uh, banshee. Yeah. No, it'll fuck you up. You don't have to do it. It'll fuck you up. For what, sure. I, was gonna, I thought you were going to make the noise. No, I'm trying to think. It was like Banshee. Is that, is that the proper term? Yeah. yeah. I think Banshee's an animal. But, um, no, they're fucked, man. I've only ever been <laughs> no, in the presence of... Fucked, eh? Yeah, I've only ever been in the uh, the presence of a cougar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A Banshee. A female spirit in Irish folklore who heralds the death of a family member. Usually by screaming, wailing, shrieking, or keening. Those people are using keen wrong. I think it has a different meaning. Thanks. I think back then, yeah. Maybe old English. Old folklore? Yeah. yeah. Folklore. Yeah. No one ever uses folklore. People say lore. Yep. Um, no, yeah, I've definitely... There's a fucking cat outside. Yeah, um, speaking of fucking shrieking. Yeah, I'll kill that Dude, before, we, you, before you came here, there's two people fighting in my lobby. And they were, like, yelling at each other. One was very, very European. The other no. was very... Uh, For real. I think... Can I don't you... know where she was from, but they were both... They couldn't, um, like, both their English was bad, mm -hmm. and I guess they were beefing, and then one of this woman's dog, this works into this story, 
bit the shit out of this other girl. Good. So then they're both running up the stairs, and I live yeah. right beside the stairs so I can hear all the door slam. And they're like, she got bit by the dog, man, and she said, your dog just bit me. Good day. I said good day. No. No so way. So they both follow each other out. And I'm following this because I can hear it from my door. I can hear it from this side of the apartment because that, that's the exit. And I can walk out to my deck and I still keep watching them. Yeah. And I'm like, and they're Jesus. fighting, they're yelling. At, I'm going to call the police right yeah. now. First of all, I look at the dog. No, brother. No, that, like, that you let that me. thing bite you? Brother. And then I look at the person who got bit or allegedly got bit. She's wearing cowgirl boots up here and jeans that cover the boots. You're good. I'm like, you didn't get bit. Where'd you get bit? Yeah. Huh? On your Were you trying to venom? pet the dog? Were you trying to get the fuck out of here? Yeah. The blah, 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 blah. You want to do me a favor? Can you can you write down uh, just these two words? Mechanical question mark, and then no exclamation point. <laughs> Why? You want to tell us? Or? No, that's just that's for Peter afterwards. Um, this is a little Easter egg for him. Yeah. Um, that story is so funny. Oh, you've heard it already. I know the story. Yeah. Oh, that sucks shit. Well, that's that one then. Oh, um, no, this yeah, I've definitely. Recording. Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's fifty-eight minutes. It's Damn. fifty-eight minutes on the second one. So that means we've done like, yeah, it's been an hour and twenty. We probably we can start to skedaddle out here. Really rock up. Hey, oh yeah, really I was just thinking that. Oh, we could end yeah. this for yeah, sure. Yeah, let, yeah, me but, let me get bring it back up the co-op pissing. No, it's good. Uh, the cook. We get the oh the co-op pissing. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Oh yeah, shout out to that. Damn. Well. Yeah. I mean, before we hop off, why don't you just come sit down in my chair, Quinn? We'll switch positions. Yeah, you're gonna be you're gonna be on the pod, brother. Are you getting hot seated? What is this? Yeah, yeah. getting hot seated. I well, since we talked about it last episode, I guess I'm getting kicked off the podcast. Shit on you, Jackson. Do my new host. Get absolutely shit on. Bye, Jackson. Take a seat. Forever. Oh. It's exciting. Is this? That's exactly how he does it. That's the yeah. most. Just get uh, real. Just get real comfy, brother. Oh uh, well. You just man spread it out. My camera is. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, you want to go sit down too? No. You want to come? You want to come swap with me, brother? <laughs> <laughs> this is how it feels, man. Feels like I've just taken someone's power. Yeah. yeah you. I mean, that's a power. You feel I'm not doing power. Jackson literally is. Uh, I'm intoxicated. You just. You just cuck yeah. Jackson. Yeah. Yeah. On my own. No, he's cucking like a podcast. Podcast yeah. cuck. Pod cuck. Podcast. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know what the fuck's happening right now. What am I sitting here for? Yeah. What's up? I wrote stuff on the screen. He did, and it made us giggle. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. The outro. Oh, you want to do the outro? Do you want to do the outro? He, has he doesn't the, even know the outro. He has played that like Tfue uh, or Tfue outro oh, song. Oh, the outro song. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think this is actually mint. So as soon as the bass drops, we're just gonna hit a fucking deuces. That's all we're gonna say. Just what, what, deuces. What do they do again? Don't they do like? They do this. You can do that if you want. You can do whatever you want, man. This is up. Uh, this is up to your thing. Is it? Is the TV on? Like the mute? Yeah, you have to you just hit the remote mute. Remote right that. Hit unmute. There's no way. Is this it? Maybe. <laughs> no way. You just typed an outro. Song. He did too. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Yeah. <laughs> we gotta hit the deuces. You do whatever you gotta do. You gotta hit the deuces on the thing, man. I wish I knew what the timing was on this. That sucks, shit. Yeah. That's kind of what I'm doing. Well, deuce this. <laughs> what a joke. What an actual joke. <laughs>